If you're looking for the cheapest VC and MT source, hit up 5mmo.com and use code CASSES for a 5% discount on your next purchase. Link in the description. Go and hit them up if you want VC or MT. What's up, everybody? In today's video, we have some NBA 2K20 news affecting stretch bigs and every big on the game. You guys kindly leave a like. This ain't for 100 likes of the video. Share the video to everyone in the 2K community so everyone can know this news and hit that subscribe button if you're new, returning, or it's the first time you're watching me. 90% of you guys are not subscribed, so hit that subscribe button for great 2K19 and 2K20 gameplay and videos coming out soon. And if you play Fortnite, use my content creator code CASSESLAKER24, Fortnite item store next time you make a purchase. Let's get straight into the video. Okay, to start off the video, can we make all bigs have a set shot next year, which makes 7th foot 3 dudes? See jumping 10 foot off the ground to shoot. So me two people in history and I'll be quiet. No one in the NBA who's big takes a leap off the ground. They only take like one centimeter meter. Look at Dirk Nowitzki. Look at Kevin Love. Look at Chris Tuts Porzingis. They take like a little inch, maybe not even a centimeter off the ground when they take a shot. Not saying we'll do it, but what do you think about the cutoff? The height cutoff should be. Now, people are saying 7 foot, 6 foot 10, stuff like that. In my opinion, we need to have it at least 6 foot 11, maybe 7 foot for the cutoff for these big high jumping releases. So the bases, so you can have separate bases for bigs. Like back in the old games, you couldn't have the exact same base on a big as you did on the guards, which I think is very viable because in their real NBA, if you want the game more realistic, you can't have people jumping up out of the sky into the top of the building like normal point guards like leaping as high as they can and have like 40 inch verticals off the ground when they're taking a jump shot this is the second part when this guy said not let's not leave these fools ruin 2k the heart cutoff should be seven foot three that's just stupid i was actually asking what they thought about height cutoff should be to get the more athletic jump shot bases if we decide to limit bigs that were above the cutoff this only set shots so there you have it guys, that is what they're planning to do in NBA 2K20, right here he says he's not saying we'll do it, which means in actual fact, you know 2K they lie a lot, so they say they're not going to do it when they actually are, like they said they're not going to bring back pushing and they bring it back, so you can never have their word, when he says this, they're thinking about implementing this in the game to not only make it a little bit more fair for people, like if you have say a jump shot 11 base right, on a point guard, they should not have the same amount of elevation on the shot as a stretch big does. Because um, with the elevation with the stretch big 7 foot above a guard or any player, they can just shoot over them. Easy. But cutting them off to only set shot bases makes them not jump high. It's like Dirk Nowitzki. You can only jump like a centimeter off the ground when they take their shot. And it is easier to contest. And they won't be able to shoot over those as easy, which makes the game less toxic and making defending a little bit easier for these people who do not know how to play the game because we're the game's trying to cater, like Fortnite, to the casuals. So we cannot just have the pure sweaties that play the game all day being able, like obviously you want to be able to, if you play all day, obviously you're going to be good. But having like, even bums, this even affects bums because they just take contested shots every single game and this could actually nerf them a little bit and make it better for sweaties and casual games on the game on 2k20 i think that's a really good thing they're going to implement especially since you know stretch bigs are so overpowered this year it takes zero skill to do it you know shoot over them i don't know there's a lot of skilled stretch bigs but there's a lot of unskilled ones which are casuals that just shoot over people and make easy like contested heavily contested shots because they can jump higher than a normal player on the defensive end unless they're on a seven foot three glass pure rim protector sorry a glass cleaner doesn't matter but i want to know your comments in the comment section down below how you feel if they implemented this in the nba 2k20 is it smart on their behalf what do you guys think tell me in the comment section down below let's have a discussion with you guys hit that like button man it helps me out so much share the video post it on twitter instagram everywhere help me out so much we're getting the channel out there hit the subscribe button if you are new or returning if, even if this is the first time you're watching me just hit that subscribe button we'll, you know will not regret it with the upcoming content on the channel anyway don't forget i'll catch you guys in the next one Peace.